गाइज दिस इज डॉक्टर रोहिनी शेंडे एंड वेलकम टू माई यूट्यूब चैनल सो आई हैव बीन गेटिंग मेनी क्वेश्चन अबाउट पी सी ओ डी एंड वॉट टू डू वेन यू हैव पी सी ओ डी एंड एज फार एज आई हैव सीन द रेशो एंड द परसेंटेज ऑफ वुमेन हैविंग पी सी ओ डी रिसेंटली इन पास्ट टेन ईयर्स हैव इंक्रीज अ लॉट एंड द मेन रीजन फॉर दैट is this fad which has been going on for years together that uh, go low fat don't have ghee uh, don't have the healthy fats and oils we have stopped we've literally stopped having egg yolks and these basic we have started having low fat dairy and low fat milk and all of these things so these have accumulated and because of this we have been coming across uh, issues with uh, PCOD and thyroid and other hormonal issues so i'm going to tell you some very easy very basic things that you can do for pcod i'm going to tell you some basic foods that you can include in your diet for pcod and before that as a doctor i want to tell you one thing that pcod is completely reversible and pcod can only be healed with lifestyle modifications and with diet and some fitness exercises there is no other solution to pcod there are no pills and there are no medicines so if you want to get off pcod completely you have to follow a healthy lifestyle change you have to follow a healthy diet and a healthy exercise routine otherwise the pcod is not going to get completely resolved whatever medicines whatever pills uh, you find in the market whatever we as doctors prescribe is Uh, a treatment of the symptoms of PCOD. It is not the treatment of PCOD as a disease. So you need a lot of hormone balancing foods. You need a good amount of muscles in your body, and you need to basically fix, uh, you know, your hormones. So there are these vitamins which are called vitamin D, uh, vitamin A, vitamin E, and vitamin K. So these are fat soluble vitamins, and to absorb these, you need a lot of. Uh, foods which are uh, rich in these vitamins and which actually help uh, transportation of your hormones and balancing your hormones so for that you need to include some healthy fats and fatty acids uh, you need good amount of omegas in your body so that is 3 6 and 9 all three omegas uh, you need good amount of greens so in this uh, video i'm going to basically tell you everything that you can do for pcod So PCOD uh, is a hormonal issue and it's completely reversible. So first of all, stop freaking out. If you're not losing weight and if you're blaming it to PCOD, it's a very stupid reason. You can't really blame it on PCOD because uh, both the things are related to each other. So it's uh, you know, uh, I don't think uh, you are not losing weight because of PCOD. And if you have PCOD, the main treatment is, is weight loss. So number one, start with some body activity. So just to begin with for first two weeks start going for walks uh go for 60 minutes walk morning and evening both it will help you very well uh with PCOD other than that what you can do is uh after two weeks or if you're already into walking and if your physical activity is pretty good start weight training your PCOD will get resolved with weight training only and if you have not if you're not used to any weight training or if you're not used to any body activity first two weeks morning and evening go for an hour walk and after that after two weeks start with weight training because it is very necessary to balance your hormones and when you carry more muscle in your body your body automatically starts uh, increasing your metabolism and it helps you reach your steady weight faster so uh, after exercise second most important thing is meditation you have to start meditating for 15 to 20 minutes uh to release the stress to release the anxiety to release the kind of depression that you have when you're you're on a hormonal disturbances you really need that time alone you need to close your eyes for 20 minutes put on a meditation music put on any mantra or shlok or whatever uh gives you positivity and higher vibrations uh put that on for 20 minutes at least morning and evening both and it will give you wonders uh wonderful results with your health and also with your mind so and always remember any process uh, whether it is about weight loss whether it is about healthy eating or whether it is something that you are trying to do with your life it all starts in mind so your mind has to be healthy for that so start with 20 minutes of meditation Uh, after 20 minutes of meditation what i want you guys to do is um, here's when food comes into the picture 
सो आई हैव बीन टॉकिंग अ लॉट अबाउट बटर कॉफी विच इज बेसिकली ब्लैक कॉफी विद वन टेबल स्पून ऑफ घी इन इट आई डू अ लॉट ऑफ वेरिएशन इन इट सो दिस खुकन दिसमी ऑन देर आर लॉट ऑफ थिंग्स बट बेसिकली वेन यू वेक अप इन द मॉर्निंग स्टार्ट विथ वन टेबल स्पून ऑफ घी विथ इन वन कप ऑफ ब्लैक कॉफी ब्लेंडेड इन अ ब्लेंडर एंड हैव इट विथ सेवन टू एट आलमंडस दिस इज हाउ यू सपोज टू स्टार्ट विथ योर डे आफ्टर दैट यू कैन मूव टू योर ब्रेकफेस्ट but one thing that you have to include in your diet if you have pcod is 1 tablespoon of ghee so if you're not a coffee person if you don't like coffee it's okay just have warm water and ghee it'll give you wonderful benefits second thing that you have to do for pcod is other than 1 tablespoon of ghee you have to eat 1 tablespoon of coconut uh, oil in warm water that could be uh, either before your dinner so that is 20 minutes before your dinner or lunch because uh, ghee you will be having in the morning so these two things will basically help your fat soluble vitamins uh, get absorbed well in your system and it will help you balance your hormones other than that another super food for pcod uh, is bone broth that is paya soup it works it has collagen it has all the amino acid and uh, it works really well on your gut also so basically it heals your digestive tract also so uh, bone broth is perfect for pcod other than bo- bone broth you can go with egg yolks whenever you have eggs do not skip the yolk that's the worst thing you can do to your body because uh, half the protein calcium vitamin d biotin and most of the b complex uh, vitamins are present in yolk so there's nothing that you're eating uh, in egg white uh, nut- as a nutrient and also it has uh, good cholesterol so make sure you don't skip yolk especially if you have pcod and other than that include uh, sesame seeds pumpkin seeds sunflower seeds flax seeds so you can just mix it up roast it and uh, carry it in your dabba as your snack and you can snack on it uh, stick to one fruit in a day other than that uh, stay away from gluten foods so that is chapati that is oats don't have gluten foods stay away from dairy completely so no milk no milk products and other than pcod if you want to stay away from milk and you don't know why uh, i have another video about why dairy is harmful for your health i have explained all the reasons in it so do watch that video so gluten free diet uh, lactose that is dairy free diet include all the super food if you are not having chapati that means you can have bhakri you can have nachni jwari or you can have bajri bhakri uh, other than that you can have rice Uh, if you're not digesting brown rice well you can soak your rice go with good amount of protein in your diet um have sprouts have good amount of dal make sure you're on high probiotic foods so don't skip on uh, dahi don't skip on buttermilk uh even if it's a dairy product buttermilk has uh, less amount of lactose in it and it's fermented so it's going to help you uh, heal your gut and uh, yeah but until you are trying to resolve your pcod stay away from buttermilk and yogurt also instead you can just take a probiotic capsule or a supplement so that will help you with your gut health and uh, other than that in the end what is important is you have to believe in yourself you have to be very patient you have to give about 120 days that is the lifespan of your rbcs that is 4 months to the process and to yourself be very grateful for everything you're doing and don't expect everything to happen fast uh, you have to enjoy the process and you have to include that as a lifestyle uh, in as a part of your life so don't be very uh, impatient very restless or don't be in a hurry to do everything uh, take it day by day live in the present and enjoy the process because there's a lot more that it's it is going to give you other than resolving your pcod so make sure that you include all of this Uh, as a lifestyle change in your uh, diet and in your life and always remember it's never just a diet it's always a lifestyle so stay healthy stay fit stay grateful and stay blessed if you have any relative or any friend or anyone who has pcod uh, share this video with her uh, this will definitely uh, help her and uh, pass the message on pass the video on and uh, you can watch my other videos i have started doing a lot of vlogs so oh you know it's it's a lot of fun and i can share a lot of aspects about my life uh, in those vlogs with you guys so i hope you enjoy all of that and um, thank you so much for being such a lovely audience thank you so much